It's Monday and time for another phonics job this week, ladybirds, isn't it? Fantastic. Oh, now then, I've found and made my favourite hat. I think this one's here to stay, boys and girls. What do you think of my hat? What do you notice around the top of my hat? Are they our phonic sounds that we've been learning? E. on the hat. This is my phonics hat. Oh, I found it. It's here to stay. This is my very favourite hat to help you with your sound. And when I'm writing on the board, when I turn my head like this in the lesson, you might spot some more sounds on the back. Let's see how many you can spot and you can shout out in the lesson when you can see a sound that you recognise. Right, today we are going to recap two sounds that we have learnt together whilst you've been learning at home but we haven't practised them or recap them in a little while. So last week we were doing A, E, I, O, but remember we've been learning six new sounds whilst you've been at home. You might know what the two missing sounds are. You might know them already. Let's have another look at them and let's do some work this week on these two sounds to help us practice and learn these sounds. Right, you ready? Have you had a little think? Oh, you might even see them on our phonics hat. This is Reed's phonics hat. You might even have a little go at making one of these yourself. If you've got an old hat at home or an old t-shirt, you might make a phonics t-shirt with all of the sounds that you know. Right, here we go. The first sound we're going to look at is Ooh, can you remember this song we played when we were learning this sound together? It goes ooh, 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 ooh. Can you remember it? Yeah, so it was I ran to the zoo, a cow went moo, a ghost went boo, so I ran to the loo. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, it's a catchy song, that one. Because on the back of the card, we have the man who works at the zoo. He's the zookeeper. And he is looking after the elephants. This says elephants. And on his top, he has the word zoo. Zoo, zoo. And in his bucket here, he has to pick up and collect all of the elephant poo. So for the oo sound, we say poo at the zoo. Poo at the zoo. Poo at the zoo. So let's see if we can have a little go at writing that caption together. So think that this might be your page in your book. So pretend my big board is your page in your book. You could pop a little picture of a zookeeper collecting his smelly elephant poo at the top. You could write the oo sound. You know it's an o and an o to make the oo sound. And then see if underneath you can write its caption. So how many words was in the caption? Let's think. Poo at the Zoo. How many words? Four words in the caption. Let's see if we can write it together. So the first word was p -p poo. Let's see if we can write it. P -p -p. We can hear the p sound. P -p. And then what can we hear? What can we hear? Oo. How do we make oo again? Oh, yes, use the card and off to make the oo sound. Ooh. Right, then let's go back and see if we can work out what's next in our sentence. Poo, what 
was the second word? At, that's right. But before I can write at, I need a finger space. So at, you can be shouting the sounds at me along with me. So poo, at, what comes next? Poo, at, the, I would, ooh, it's a, mm, it's a tricky word. That one, isn't it? We've just got to remember the three letters that makes the. Can you think of the three letters that makes the? Are we ready? The finger space. It's made of a T, a H, and an F. So, so far we've got poo, at, the. Where was the poo? Where is it? Is it in the park? Where is the poo? At the zoo. Excellent. So we can hear z at the beginning. Now, z is a tricky one to form, but we need to say zig, zag, zig. And then we need our oo sound at the end. Let's read it back to check it makes sense. Here we go. Who at, at the zoo. So you could have a little go in your book at drawing the picture and then writing the caption underneath and then oh you might even be able to list some ooh words that you could remember i might go through some now just to give you some clues what about two zoo mood fill pool stool moon spoon so many words with the ooh sound in it's a long stretch sound isn't it right let's have a look at the next sound we're going to be thinking about today because afterwards we're going to make do a sorting activity of both of these sounds right let's rub this one off i hope it's in your book you need to pause the video if you need to and you can have a little go at writing the matching caption for oo and then we're going to replace the oo sound with our next sound for today which is a and a er. can you remember what a and a er makes i'll give you a clue there's a picture on the back of a red car there's people in the back there's even a clown it makes R, R for start, turn on those engines and to, um, turn the wheel because we're starting the car. Start the car. So let's pop this sound up and we'll have a look at this one next. So I'm sure you could draw a fabulous red car. Get your colouring pencils and colour it in on the next page. You could draw a clown in there and a lady. And there's a man in there with a top hat on, just like mine. Let's see if we can write the R sound underneath, which is with a A and a R. R. And we're going to try and use this sound in our caption here underneath, okay? So let's do the first word. It was start the car. Oh, so this time it's one less than before. We had four in our caption before, four words. This time it's only three words. You ready? So start. What sound can you hear at the beginning? S good. S -t -t. Can you hear the t in there? T -t. Start. Start. St -st. Ah. And then what comes next in our sentence? Start. The, oh, there's our tricky word that can you remember the three letters we used last time? Finger space. Remember it's a t with a h and an f. We can't put any sound buttons underneath there because that's a tricky word. Start the bus. Start the lorry. What is it with the R sound? Start the car. Excellent. Finger space. K R. Car. Start 
the car. Excellent. Well done. Okay. If you need to pause the video to give yourself a chance to write, start the car and do your lovely picture. And then as an extra challenge, see if you can list some R words underneath. Then you can pause, play the video, press, press play on the video again. And then we're going to sort them. And we're going to sort using some pictures. So I'm going to pop the R sound on this side of my page. So if you want to do this at home, remember, pretend this is your book. I've got a big page like in your book. You could put the R sound at the top like this. And then the ooh sound at the top on the other side. So underneath here will be everything that has the R sound. And underneath here will be everything that has the ooh sound under there. Right, let's have a look at some pictures and see if you can help me decide. Ooh, has it got the ooh sound or the R sound? Ooh, are you ready? Here we go. We'll have a look at this one. Ready? Oh, what is it a picture of? What is it a picture of? What can you see? What's the biggest thing in the middle of the picture? It's a moon. That's right. The moon comes out at night to give us light. The moon. So when we hear and we say moon, what sound can you hear? Can you hear ooh or ah? Moon. Let's sound it out together. Ready? M, mm, ooh, m, mm, moon. That's right. It has the ooh sound in. And I've even got the word here. M, mm, ooh, m, mm, moon. So we can pop the picture of the moon with, oops, was I putting it on the right sound there, boys and girls? Is that right? That this is the oo sound? No, silly Mrs. Reed. Put, put it over on the other side. There's the moon. And we'll put the word moon to go with it. Moon. I'll just turn my table so you can see them all. Right. Let's have a look at the next picture. Oh, this picture has trees in it and grass and a path and a lovely blue sky. Are you ready to see? Oh, what word could we think of that might have one of today's sounds in? Could we think of anything with the ooh sound in? Mm. Can we hear ooh in tree? No, we can hear the e sound in tree. Um, can we hear the oo sound in path? No. Think about where we are. Where are we? Where do you think they are? They've gone out for a walk and they've decided to go to the p -p 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 park. Oh, if we use the word park. Do we have one of today's sounds in that word? Park. I can hear the R sound, can you? Oh, we're doing so well together. Catch my air high five. We've got the word park in there. Let's Fred talk it on our fingers. P R K P R K. Right, let's pop it with the R sound there. Park. I might even have the matching word to go with it. I do indeed. Are you ready to see what it looks like? So there's our first sound. P -p -p. Then we have our two letters R, P R, K, Park. So we can pop the word next to the picture of the park. Oh, let's have a look at another picture. Oh, this picture. I can see a man and the man is in a kitchen. I wonder what word we can think of that might have the oo sound or the ah sound. Let's see which one we get from this picture. Oh, so what, think about what is the man doing? He's a chef. 
He's called a chef because he likes to make food. But what is he doing? He likes to cook. That's right, he likes to cook his food. Cook. He's cooking food. Cooking. So, ooh. Which one of these is the ooh sound? Is it this one? No, is it this one? It is, that's right, ooh for kook. And I've even got the matching word to go with it. Are you ready to read it? K, ooh, k, kook. So we can pop that next to the picture of the man kooking. Okay, right, let's have a look at another picture. Oh, this one is fantastic. <gasps> this one. I'll give you some clues and see if you can guess what it is. You ready? It has four wheels. Mm. It can go really fast. You can get inside of it. It has a steering wheel. It has a handbrake. For when we need to stop. What is it a picture of? That's right, it's a car. But look at how fantastic this car is. Have a little look. It's a car, boys and girls. Look at that. Mrs. Reed would love a car just like that. So in the word car, can we hear ah or oo? Ah car. We can hear the ah sound. Excellent, well done. Ah. So we'll pop it up over here with the oo. No, silly Mrs. Reed. Need to move it and pop it underneath the ah sound. And we'll have a look at its matching word. This is what it looks like. These are the sounds you need for car. K ah, k ah, car. Well done. We'll pop it over here like that and then I've got two more pictures left two more right let's see what you think this one might be ready oh looks a lovely place to be that looks an exciting place to be There's some children there what do you think they're doing yeah, they're feeding an elephant, aren't they? They're feeding an elephant. So where do you think they might be? At the zoo, at the zoo. Zoo has the oo sound in. I ran to the zoo. A cow went moo. Oo, 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 oo. Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's have a look at how we would write and the sounds, what sounds we need for zoo. You ready? Zzz, zzz, ooh, zoo, zzz, ooh. And we'll put the zoo next to the picture. And the last one, are you ready? <gasps> what word? What do we call this? What word can we get from this picture? We put things inside it and then we have to fasten the lid. And oh, what material is it made from? It's made from glass, boys and girls, glass. And it's transparent, you can see through it. It's a jar, that's right, a jar. You could put anything in a jar. Money, sweets. Oh, what else? What else could we put in a jar? You tell me, what else could we pop inside this jar? Things that we want to keep safe, isn't it? So they don't come out with the lid on. Let's have a look at its matching word and the sounds that we need for jar. Jar, 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 jar. Brilliant. Right. A little activity for you to do at home, following on from writing your captions, start the car and poo at the zoo, and then writing all of those words with the sounds in. I wonder if you could pick two R words and two O words 
and see if you can put them into a sentence. You might just want to say that sentence out loud or you might want to try writing that sentence down. So see if you can come up with two sentences with one of these words in. And then you can write them or you can just say them. And I'll see you again tomorrow for another activity helping us to learn ooh and ah. Ready? Ooh and ah. Ooh and ah. Ooh ah. See if you can get faster. Ooh ah. Ooh ah. Ooh ah. And I'll see you tomorrow for another phonics activity. Bye for today. Enjoy the rest of your day. Have a lovely afternoon. And I'll see you tomorrow, which will be Tuesday. It's Tuesday tomorrow. Bye from Mrs Reid. Enjoy the rest of your day.